Welcome to Alley, our house of prayers this morning. I thank you, Lord, on today for this day that we got up, was able to speak, was able to walk, was able to just breathe and talk to each other, love on our loved ones. This is a blessing this morning. And believe it or not, it's a miracle in, in, in so many ways. Whenever God gets you up in the morning, there's something to think about. Because somebody didn't wake up this morning. I said somebody didn't wake up this morning. If they woke up this morning, they might have woke up with problems. They might have woke up with serious issues. Woke up with medical conditions. But if you woke up in great health this morning, without a walker, without a mace peeker, with every part of your body attached to you, there's a blessing in that. And I thank the Lord of today because we don't know the time or the date that the Bible says. We don't know the time or the date or the second. We're going to be called to meet the Lord. So every day is a blessing and a challenge. When we wake up, we're able to speak and breathe. One more time. Amen. I just want to just read a blessing of, of a scripture. Because it's always good to start off as a blessing. Blessings are that they which do hunger and thirst after the righteousness. For they should be filled. Blessings are the merciful, for they should attain mercy. Mercy. Blessings are the pure in the heart, for they should see God. Blessings are the peacemakers, for they should call unto the children of God. Blessings are they which are prosecuted for the righteousness sake, for there is the kingdom of heaven. Blessings are them the thee we should revoke. You and the prosecute you and should say all matters of the evil against the false for my sake. Blessings are all those who come to the Lord and give God praise this morning. And I just thank the Lord on today. Because we couldn't have made it without the Lord this morning. Amen. We couldn't have made it without the Lord this morning. And I thank the Lord on today that God make a way for us. God make a way for us. I don't know how the plug came out the wall. I ain't even touched nothing. The devil working already in so many ways. I don't. I, I, I can never figure that one out. How the pill came up the wall, and I didn't even touch anything. But we're not gonna let we're not gonna let the devil distract us this morning. But guess what? He is. He's a distraction. He's a distraction. Lord, I thank you all today because you're moving us in the right direction. You showed us righteousness and you given us hope and you blessing our hearts. And you given us a fair warning, God, that you are coming. And I thank you, Lord, today because we couldn't have done it without you. We couldn't have made it without you. You value us, God, when we wasn't valuing ourselves, God. Yes, thank you, Jesus. you gave us hope. But we didn't believe in ourselves and you 
gave us strength when we was weakening in the spirit. You lift us up, God. You gave us hope when we didn't believe we didn't have faith. But you still stay by our side through our troubles and our weakness. That you stay with us through our pains. And when we was hurting for you, God, you stripped us where we need to be stripped, God. And I thank you, Lord, today because of who you are, God. You know, man, you are spirit, God. You hold the power across the nation, and you hold the power that reveals who you are, God. God, you show us everything that you can show us. And you give us everything that we need on today, God. And I thank you, Lord, on, on today, God. Because you showed us love when we need to be loved. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. You fed us when we need to be thank fed. You, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. You gave us everything that we needed to get through this day, God. Yes, hallelujah. You fed us the word of God. You feed us the prayers. You touch us when we need to be touched in every area of our lives that been troubled. You, you touch us, God. You value us when we thought that nobody loved us, but you showed us, God, that you love us. Yes, hallelujah. You gave us value when we was down and out. You gave us value. But I thank you, Lord, today because without you, where would we be at? I truly believe, God, without you, we would be so lost. But now that we fought you, we can live in the spirit. We can live ever, ever after God. But I thank you, Lord, today that you still coming. That you still showed us of who we are. Having faith in you is a blessing, God. Yes, it is. Yes. It's a blessing to have faith in you. Thank you, Lord. And Lord, I thank you, Lord. I thank you, Lord, of today for my life. Because I know, God, I could be in a million places right now. But I chose to be here today serving you. I chose to be here today, God, giving you praise right now, God. I chose to be here today giving prayer to you, God. Lifting up somebody's spirit this morning that may be going through something this morning. But I got to tell you all today, today is your victory. Thank you, Lord. Today is your victory. Today is your day that you coming out. That you believe that God is giving away for you. Your breakthrough is near. Your breakthrough is near this morning. All you got to do is open your eyes and confess Jesus Christ. That he's Lord of your life. Yeah, hallelujah, hallelujah. And lean on the Lord when you Thank need to be leaned on. Trust him when you Thank need to, when you go through your worst tribulation. Trust God when you in your worst times. God will reveal his love to you. Lord, we thank you all today because you are blessed. You are blessed to us, God, in every way possible. Yes, you are, are blessed to us, God, because we believe, God, without you, we would have been lost yeah, in so many ways, God. You blocked us from things, God, that we couldn't even see. You blocked us from things that could have took us out. We been in here, God, this morning. Not by accident. Because of your will. Because of your love. Because of your purpose. That we here today. That we live in here today. That we here today, God. Because of your will. Yeah, because of your purpose. Thank you, Jesus. We have no say so, God. When it's time, when it's time to come and meet our maker, Lord, I thank you all today. I 
thank you on today. Let the fire come in its place. Let the Holy Ghost have this way. Let the Holy Ghost have this way this morning. I call the Lord Lord this morning to come down in this place. Wash our sins in the name of Jesus. That you give us a, a free spirit, God. That you give us a free will to serve you all today, God. That you come down in this place and do your will, do your work, God. And I thank you, Lord, for the Holy Ghost have this way this morning. Show up and show out. Do your work this morning, God. Let the Holy Ghost reveal itself this morning. Let the power come down in this place you, and wash and cleanse our life this morning. We call on the Holy Spirit right now in the name of Jesus. That you come and have your way with us, God, that you touch us in the right direction, God, that you give us what we need. We call on you and today, God, to come in the name of Jesus. We need to see you this morning, God. We need to hear your voice this morning. Have your way this morning, God. Have your way this morning, God. Do what you want to do. How you want to do it, God. We thank you, Lord, for the Holy Ghost. Have your way. Let your presence come down in this place and wash away our sins this morning. We call on your help this morning, God. Let your help come this morning, God. Let your angels come and surround us this morning, God. Let your angels show up this morning, God. And touch somebody this morning. Heal about a sickness this morning. Help somebody this morning, God. If they raise their hands up, God. If they're on their knees this morning, God. If they're in the hospital this morning. Go into the hospital this morning. Touch a sick body this morning. Put your hands on a sick body this morning. Lift the up by the spirit, God. Go into the jail hospital this morning. I pray over the White House this morning. I pray over the hospital this morning, Father. Touch those in the hospital this morning. Touch those that's in the operation this morning. Touch the doctors this morning. Somebody need help this morning. If you're sick in your body this morning, raise your hand up to God this morning. Tell God what you want this morning. Tell the Lord what you need this morning. Lord, I need your help this morning. If you need God help this morning, open up your mouth this morning. Tell the Lord I need your help. I need you right now, God. Come down in my house, God. Come in my car this morning. Walk with me, Jesus. No matter where you at, if you in your car, if you at work, if you in your house, if you're homeless, if you're in a shelter, if you're in a hospital, if you go, if you're in a correction facility this morning, no matter where you at, God will save you this morning. Open up your mouth this morning and let the Lord know what you want. He's a peacemaker. He's a well maker. He's a healer this morning. He's everything that you need. He's everything that you want. All you gotta do is believe. All you gotta do is tell God what you want. All you gotta do is tell God what you need. Somebody need to open up their mouth. Somebody need to shout this morning. Somebody need to believe this morning. We ain't here by mistake, but we here by God's will. But we here on our purpose. And so the Lord this morning to give God some praise, to walk by faith. Blessings are coming. All oh, blessings are coming down because of your favor, because of your will, because of your work. I didn't come in this morning to keep my mouth shut. I didn't come in this morning got my mistake, but I came in this morning ready to serve God. 
let us know her that things are going to come to pass. He let us know her our troubles are not ours. He let us know her that we can make it. He let us know her that we can stand by favor. Jesus let us know her. Don't give up. He let us know her that we can hold on. He let us know her our bodies don't belong to us. He let us know her our faith is real. He let us know her that only father that we have. He let us know her that we can do it with him alone. He let us know her that we can love him. He let us know her that we are valued. He let us know her not to forget his name. He let us know her our hearts should be with him. He let us know her who we are. He remind us of who we are. He remind us what we can do. He remind us we can love each other. God remind us that we are the one spirit. He let us know that we can do all things by Christ. He let us know as long as we can believe in him, things will come to pass. We can count on Jesus Christ. We can pray in the spirit. We can do things by the power of his work. Thank you, Lord, this morning for your work, for your sake, that you're moving in the spirit, that you're coming right now in the name of Jesus. Somebody needs to say the name of Jesus. If you know something right now, you better call out the name of Jesus that holds the power, that sits on the throne, that do miracles, that bring wonders, that turn your life around. He gets you out from that rock. He gets you out from your troubles. He gets you out when nobody likes it. He gets you out when your enemy was coming. He turned your life around. He did some wonders in your life. I can remember when I had nothing. I can remember when I was going through something. But God says, turn your life around. If you believe in me, you can follow me. I thank you, Lord, on today for a thing that taking place in the name of Jesus. Oh, Lord, thank you, Jesus, for your love and joy, for your wonders, for the power that you have today, God. Come down in this place and let the power come. I'm calling on you, Jesus, to come down in this place. Bring your angels. Bring your power. Bring the fire of the Holy Ghost. Bring the fire of the Holy Ghost. And come right now. Take away some sin. Take away some doubt. Take away some fear. Take away some things in the inside that have been bounding us out. And turn us around. Give us hope. Give us fire. Bring the fire down. Oh, thank you, Jesus. We didn't come here this morning to play with your spirit. But we came here this morning with a word. We came here this morning ready to serve you. We came here this morning with victory in our hearts. Oh, Lord, thank you, Jesus. Oh, thank you, Jesus, for the Holy Ghost, for the fire, for the will of your work. For us to submitted to We are submitted to you, God. There's nothing that can take us away from you, God. There's nothing that can separate us from you, God. That devil is a liar. He's a demonic spirit. He break your heart. He do things in the spirit. He do one and do some evil things. But I'm here to tell you all today, your enemy gonna be defeated because of no work. The devil gonna be defeated because of who you know. That's Jesus Christ. Your enemy gonna get under your feet because of your love, because of your faith that you have in Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, thank you, Jesus. We didn't come here this morning to play with your spirit, but we came here this morning by the work of your will, by the faith in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. 
Have your way this morning. Have your way this morning. In the name of Jesus. Victory is coming this morning to those who believe in you, God. Victory coming here this morning. If you want to get healed in your body this morning, if you want something from God this morning, whatever it is on today that you need, just tell God on today and open up your mouth this morning and open up your hearts and give yourself to God this morning. Oh, God, thank you, Jesus, that we already been given everything that we have to you, Lord. There's nothing hidden in the spirit. You can tell God right now what you need. God will understand. God will understand what you want. God will give you something that man can't give you. God can give you healing this morning. God can bring your hope back this morning. He can bring your courage this morning. He can bring your faith back this morning. He can deal with your consequences. He can deal with your situation. He can take you out your situation. Your situation is not yours. Everything that you're going through is not yours this morning. As long as you give it to God this morning, God will take it away from you. Everything that you're going through this morning, you ain't going through it alone because God is with you. All you got to do, tell God, I need your help this morning. Lord, I need your help this morning. If you need God help this morning, tell God I need your help. I know I need the Lord help this morning. I know I want the Lord help this morning. I need you this morning, God. Come right now, God. Come in this place right now. Come and ask that house of prayers this morning. Touch this ministry today, God. Heal this ministry today, God. Put a covering over this ministry today, God. I thank you, Lord, on today for this ministry. That you're doing something great, God. That you're doing some wonders for this ministry. That you turn it around, God. Bless this ministry today, God. You value us, God. In the name of Jesus, you value us like we never been valued. You gave us hope and will, God. You love us when nobody loved us. You stayed by us when nobody wasn't there, God. You got us through sickness when we were laying in the bed. The devil tried to take us out. That demonic spirit wanted to lay on us. But you got it off us because we asked you to, God. Because we prayed it off for you, God. Anything that we pray in the spirit, it must come to pass. The devil must get under our feet. The demonic spirit is coming after you. As long as you don't have faith, you better believe that in the name of Jesus. But if you got faith, you better speak it. If you got faith, you better walk in it. In the name of Jesus, I thank you, Lord, for your name. Because your name have power. It demand it brings up it brings things to you. It defeat the demonic spirit. Your name alone fight things. Your name alone already in the kill everything. They try to come against you. Your name hold power. In the name of Jesus. I think that name is so great. It's so good to have a friend that you can call on. It's good to have somebody that you can depend on. His name is Jesus Christ. I thank you for your name. Your name alone have power. Your name is so beautiful. Your name sounds so good. Your name have mercy. Your name is flavor. In the name of Jesus. Thank you for your father. That's jealous. Thank you for your father. That name jealous. Jealous means he love you. You don't want me. You can't have, you don't want nobody but you. You better believe that. That's a blessing that God wants you. That's a blessing that God don't want to share you. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord, on today, God, because you're so good to us. You did everything that you can do, God. I'm calling on you on today, God, because I... 
I need you this morning. I need you to touch somebody. I'm praying for the families. I'm praying for the sisters in love. I'm praying for the families. I'm praying for the brothers and sisters. For the mothers and elders. I'm praying for the grandchildren. I'm praying for those need to be prayed on. Those need to be touched this morning. Touch them this morning, God. Change the things around this morning. Go into the streets and touch the homeless. Just the elders go into the nursing homes. Heal somebody in the nursing homes. Just those that 95 years old that still trying to find a way. Give them their minds back, God. Give them their health back this morning, God. In the name of Jesus, God. Strengthen those that need to be strengthened. I thank you, Lord, for the Holy Ghost. I thank you for the power. I thank you for your love. In the name of Jesus, have your way this morning. Do what you want to do. How you want to do it. I'm calling on your help this morning. I need your help this morning. I want your love this morning. I need your complete presence on today, God. In the name of Jesus. Oh, in the name of Jesus. Oh, in the name of Jesus. Have your way this morning. Have your way this morning. And I hear this. Lord, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord, on today. Because you sound so you so good to us. I thank you, Lord, for everything that you've done in our lives. How you blessed us in the way you blessed us. Couldn't have done nothing without you. Wouldn't want to be without you. Thank you, Lord, for allowing us to be here in your presence today one more time. Anything could have happened, but you blocked it. Things that we couldn't see. But, Lord, I thank you because, Lord, it's a blessing to have you. But I thank you, Lord, continue to bless this ministry. Continue to bless my wife. Continue to touch her heart. Put a covering over her. Let her continue to be the ministry she is. Continue to give her the words that she need to be, that she need in her heart, and that, that she can speak. Trust this family. Protect this family. Any, any spirit that, that, that don't belong to you, I ask you to drive it out to this morning. And put your heart, put your love in their hearts this morning. The enemy is trying to destroy so many people. And he, and he has succeeded. Because people are losing faith in you, God. People are losing faith in you. And they turn into things of the world. But God, we know that you can change things around. If they only believe and give you a second chance. We're not asking you. You said that we, we're not perfect. You said no man perfect. But you said that if we can love you and trust you and walk by faith, a change will come. And I'm asking for a change. Because I know, God, that you can do all things by, by the power of your name, by the power of your mercy. And I thank you, Lord, on today. Because we are living in victory. We are living in victory right now. Every day is a blessing to be able to see one more day. One more day, one more minute. We don't know when we're going to leave this place. And I thank you, Lord, on today because we here on today. On this day, Sunday, sun is shining. And we're here to see it. And Lord, we thank you on today. Hallowed be our name. Thank you, Jesus. We glorify you. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen.